Let's talk about work. Is your work safe? Do you earn what you were promised? Do you have a contract that explains your rights? If not, there's something you can do. At the Work Rights Center, we believe that everyone has the right to work that is fair, safe, and that pays. Getting your employment rights starts with finding out your employment status. An employee who works regularly enjoys the highest level of protection. A casual or zero hours worker has many rights too. As for the self-employed, their rights are limited, but they are still entitled to the pay they were promised. Remember, even if you don't have written terms and it all seems informal, if you work regularly, long term, for someone who controls what you do, you are at least entitled to the protection of a worker. If you work on an occasional basis, you are at least entitled to pay and safety. So let's get to it. Step one. Once you know your employment status, it's time to talk to your boss. Try to negotiate your terms, suggest ways to settle, and remind them that you are legally entitled to a number of protections. Step two. Start to gather evidence. Any text messages or phone logs, emails, pictures, timesheets, or witnesses that may support your case. Step three. Write a letter to your boss. Use the evidence to write a grievance letter, or, if you've stopped working, a letter before action. Outline the issue. Suggest a solution. Do you need back pay? A contract? Annual leave? Then, give your boss a time to address it. Always send the letter by recorded delivery. Step four. If nothing happens, it's time to go to court. If you think you're self-employed, you can take your boss to the small claims court. If you're a worker or an employee, First contact the Advisory, Conciliation and Arbitration Service. ACAS will try to mediate the issue. If that fails, you can finally take your employer to the Employment Tribunal. It sounds complicated, but we can help at the Work Rights Centre. Take a moment to learn more on our website or visit us for a free and confidential consultation. And remember, everyone has the right to work that is fair, safe and that pays. Work Rights Centre, www.workrightscentre.org.